The church leaders in Ilori, the Kwara State capital, have expressed optimism over Nigeria's capacity to overcome the current national challenges bordering on insecurity and economic hardship. The leaders who disclosed this during the Easter service messages across various churches also called on the political class to be service-driven in delivering good governance to the people as a way of expressing love as exemplified by Jesus Christ. I will say that the resurrection of the Lord Jesus Christ itself is indeed a dawn of hope to us as Nigerians. I will say that there is still hope for us. There is hope for us if only we can put our faith in God through Jesus Christ. Even our leaders allowing the fear of God to rule their heart and the Spirit of God even to lead them. Just as the same way God has demonstrated love even to humanity by even making sacrifice and leaders having the fear of God in their hearts can also even demonstrate love even for the masses by allowing the fear of God ruling their hearts and taking care of them but to the Nigerians I will say there is still a hope. This is not the first time Nigeria will express experience hardship. So as a child of God what I will suggest to the leadership is to turn their hearts to God. In periods of hardship, you turn to God, the maker of heaven and earth, and seek his face, and return to him from evil, wickedness, ungodliness, whatever names you are called, which you know is contrary to him. You know that God will accept you because Christ came for the forgiveness of our sins. Actually, our experience may not be also far from some of the sins we have committed. So we should repent of our sins. We and our leaders, or our leaders and we ourselves, and expect God to receive us as he has promised us in 2 Corinthians, that he will be merciful unto us, and he will also heal our land. The specialist Sunday service also provided another opportunity for renewed calls on citizens to rededicate themselves to the teachings of Jesus Christ. <laughs> 